What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel and for today I'm going to be announcing my first ever giveaway, the winner of my first ever giveaway and I'm really excited about it. Um, the, like I said before, the winner will be getting the VIP poster. So, okay, before I do that, there's a couple things that I wanted to address really quickly and um, it's actually kind of sad. Like, I've been seeing all over the Fall Out Boy fan base that people are under the assumption that Fall Out Boy is either going on another hiatus or that they are breaking up and people have been really upset. Like, I've actually seen videos of people crying and stuff, but, like, Fall Out Boy is not breaking up. Fall Out Boy is not going on another hiatus. I don't know why everyone jumps to all of these, like, crazy conclusions because they have not said that anywhere. If anything... They've said that they're taking a break. And yes, I see how that can be kind of confusing because they always refer to the hiatus as a little break, even though we all know that it wasn't a little break. Um, they just want some time to spend with their families and not do so much heavy touring. Like, I think everybody as people should be able to understand that. And, you know, let's just recap here for a second, starting from when they came back. You know, they came back with an album, Save Rock and Roll, completely done. They toured that album that whole 2013 year, you know, with their, like, little um, smaller, like, comeback tour. And then their Save Rock and Roll tour, um, you know, 2014 comes along. They, they're touring. They're doing Monument Tour. You know, they released um, Pac Sam Days, like, an, another, like, little EP album. You know, then they released Centuries, like, literally right after Monumentor is done. And then slowly American Beauty, American Psycho comes out. They, you know, release, or they go on tour with Wiz Khalifa over the summer for that giant Boys of Summer tour. They do a bunch of radio shows, like, all, like, last Christmas. And then they had Wind Tour. They released their remix album for American Beauty, American Psycho. And that is a lot for anybody to do any like if you think about it how many like music artists really stuff and tour that often like they need a break so they don't end up going on hiatus again I feel like the fan base just expects them to do so much all the time when that's just kind of like impossible and we don't want them to completely like you know lose their minds again have to go on hiatus and I have a feeling if they were to ever, like, go on hiatus again, they wouldn't come back. You know what I mean? It would be like, okay, we're done. So I think us as a fandom need to respect them as people, respect them as human beings, and just be grateful for everything they have given us so they don't, like, completely, like, you know, get super tired or sick of each other or just don't stop loving what they're doing. Like, we should respect them on this break, you know, keep supporting them. And, you know, and the thing is, too, like, yeah, Pete said they're not going to tour the U.S. again for a while, but he said until they have new music, and he said they will have new music, so I don't know where these, like, crazy rumors are coming from of them breaking up or going on hiatus or, because it's nothing to freak out about. They're people, you know? Like, other bands don't put it out, put out different albums or tour every single year. Like, that doesn't happen. And we should be grateful that when Fall Out Boy is, you know, pumped and, you know, refreshed, they do tour a lot. We do get to see them a lot. They do put out a lot of music. So I just, it's, instead of complaining about it, I feel like we just need to be grateful for it. Okay? So that's just, like, my little two cents on that. I like, didn't mean to get, like, super deep on it. But it's just, it makes me sad that people are getting so upset over absolutely nothing and we don't want them to get completely, like, worn out again. So, I don't know. Okay, so back on a happier note, I am about to announce the contest winner. I'm really excited about it. All right, so this is how I'm going to do it. I put all of your guys' names in this random name app thing. Like, all of you guys are in there. Like, so many people, like, entered this contest. But I went in, put everybody who... um you know, once, you know, once the poster into this random name generator, and then it picks a random name out, and that will be the winner, so, okay, you guys ready, and uh, this is, like, the fairest way I could think of, too, like, I'm not I'm just gonna, like, pick, like, a, a favorite, I, I mean, I can't do that, so it's gonna be completely random, and, yep, here we go, pick a random name, and the winner is Martin Crosby, Martin, you have 48 hours to direct message me either on um, Instagram or Facebook or anything. Direct message me your address, and you will be winning a the VIP Fall Out Boy poster. And I will mail that out as soon as you DM me your address. So 
yeah, that's really, really exciting. And um, I'll do another one just in case um, he does not, he, I'm, I'm assuming it's a guy, but it might be a girl. Um, just in case they do not get back to me, I will um, pick another name as a backup. So, but I'm not going to tell you guys who that is. So I'll just screenshot it so you guys can see it if that comes to that again. So yeah, you have uh, Martin Crosby. You have 48 hours to let me know your address, and I will ship you out the VIP poster. Thank you all for entering my first ever giveaway, and there will be plenty more. I already have some ideas for a second one that I'll be doing here shortly. So yeah, everyone, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for liking. I love reading all of your comments. You guys just you guys mean so much to me, and I'm so blessed that you guys care about my opinion on things. So. Yeah, all right, I will guess I will see you guys next time, and stay classy.